Current Affairs of the 21st of May 2021. Today's top Pakistan current affairs the 21st of May 2021 with download link available in PDF. These are the latest breaking news about Pakistan which will be helpful for aspirants in test preparation of current affairs, Pakistan affairs, general knowledge for NTS, PPSC, CSS, FPSC, KPPSC, SPSC, BPSC, AJKPSC, OTS, PTS, and other Gov jobs, exams and MDCAT, ECAT entry test preparation. Let's get started. 1. Israel, Palestinian groups agree Gaza ceasefire. Israel, Palestinian groups agree on Gaza ceasefire. Israel and the two main Palestinian groups Hamas and Islamic Jihad announced a ceasefire aimed to end the most devastating conflict between them for seven years. 2. Vaccination for people aged 30 and older to start tomorrow. Vaccination for people aged 30 and older to start tomorrow, Umar. Federal Minister for Planning, Development, Reforms and Special Initiatives Assad Umar has on Friday announced that the coronavirus vaccination for people aged 30 and older will start tomorrow. 3. Salah Bhutani resigns as Balochistan minister. Salah Bhutani resigns as Balochistan minister. Weeks after Balochistan Chief Minister Jam Kamal Alyani stripped Sardar Mohammad Salah Bhutani of a portfolio of local government and rural development, he resigned as provincial minister on Friday. 4. Blast kills six in JUIF rally. Blast kills six in JUIF rally. At least six persons have been killed and 14 others injured by a bomb at a pro-Palestinian rally in Balochistan's Chaman City, officials said. 5. Pakistan to vaccinate teachers, support staff by June 5. Pakistan to vaccinate teachers, support staff by June 5, Ministry. The Federal Education Ministry has decided to vaccinate all teachers and support staff across the country by June 5. 6. Pakistan wants peaceful relations with all neighbors including India, PM. Pakistan wants peaceful relations with all neighbors including India, PM. Pakistan wants to maintain cordial and peaceful relations with all its neighbors including India, Prime Minister Imran Khan said. 7. Pakistan inaugurates a Chinese-made nuclear power plant in Karachi. Pakistan inaugurates a Chinese-made nuclear power plant in Karachi. Pakistan and China have a unique relationship because the countries share an emotional attachment, Prime Minister Imran Khan said. 8. Pakistan officially added to Amazon sellers list. Pakistan officially added to Amazon sellers list. Amazon, the world's largest e-commerce platform has officially added Pakistan to the list of its approved sellers. This means Pakistanis have access to the world's largest online market where they can sell their products and, if they get it right, make a fortune. 9. IMF proposes a $50 billion plan to end the coronavirus pandemic. IMF proposes a $50 billion plan to end coronavirus pandemic. Official. The IMF on Friday proposed a $50 billion plan to end the COVID-19 pandemic, with a target of vaccinating at least 40% of the world's population by the end of 2021. 10. Gold Prices. A tola of gold reaches 109,300 rupees in Pakistan. Gold's price per tola jumped 3,300 rupees in Pakistan during the week, according to the rates compiled by All Sindh Serafa Jewelers Association. 11. Pakistan Gov approves 1 rupee and 72 paise per unit increase in power tariff. Pakistan Gov approves 1 rupee and 72 paise per unit increase in power tariff. The federal cabinet approved on Friday an increase of 1 rupee and 72 paise per unit in the power tariff. Today we learn about 1. Israel, Palestinian groups agree Gaza ceasefire. 2. Vaccination for people aged 30 and older to start tomorrow. 3. 
Salah Bhutani resigns as Baluchistan minister. 4. Blast kills 6 in JUIF rally. 5. Pakistan to vaccinate teachers, support staff by June 5. 6. Pakistan wants peaceful relations with all neighbors including India, PM. 7. Pakistan inaugurates a Chinese-made nuclear power plant in Karachi. 8. Pakistan officially added to Amazon sellers list. 9. IMF proposes a $50 billion plan to end the coronavirus pandemic. 10. Gold prices 11. Pakistan Gov approves 1 rupee and 72 paise per unit increase in power tariff. Hope you like this video. Please like and share this video for our appreciation. And subscribe our channel for more informative videos. Thanks for watching.